I put my hands like this, and then the dog bit me. An eight-year-old girl attacked by a dog. Her injury so severe, she needed several stitches. Tonight, her family is still trying to track down the animal and its owner before it happens again. Good evening, everyone. I'm Maurice Dubois. And I'm Christine Johnson. CBS 2's Tracy Carrasco spoke with the victim and her family in a story that is new tonight. Blue sunscreen protects eight-year-old Catherine Yaroslavsky's face as her deep wounds continue to heal. But this is what the little girl looked like on August 30th after she was attacked by a stranger's dog at Gantry Plaza State Park in Long Island City. My brother was first. He petted it. He was fine. I petted it. I put my hands like this, and then the dog bit me. Catherine got 40 stitches in her lip, 15 in her head, and endured hours of surgery. Her mother, Maria Berezmanko, watched in horror as the dog bit her daughter twice and mauled her face. I saw just missing half of her mouth, and I was thinking, where should I find the missing pieces on the ground? Witnesses were able to take this picture of the dog, believed to be a lab pit bull mix, and the woman walking it. Berezmanko filed accident reports with the health department and the police, and says the woman gave police police a man's contact information as the alleged registered dog owner. However, the family says the owner and the woman are unreachable and have no way of knowing if this dog has had its shots or previously bitten anyone else. Uh, this dog should be treated as a dangerous animal. While Catherine's physical scars will heal over time, the traumatic emotional scars will last much longer. I'm going to not go over dogs again. I only just can't pet my own dog. Catherine's parents believe they've seen the dog in the neighborhood before, but want the owner to come forward before this dog has the chance to attack anyone else. Reporting from Long Island City, Tracy Carrasco, CBS 2 News.